No one wants to come for me for that one. And I stand by that man, I really, really do. My name is Hero Finds Tiffin and I play Hardin Scott. Oh, that's a good question. She's actually ridiculously smart. Like, she's very, very intelligent. She's really funny. She doesn't just act on set. She's just got like an awareness for, for everything that's going on, more than just turning up and saying her own lines, which is really helpful and useful to have in someone who you're working with. Someone fun to be around, someone who is confident, likes to watch movies, but likes an adventure too. Play some sports, but maybe just like explore, get out, be active and try, try new things. It's funny how when you start doing that, you literally can't help but sound like someone on Love Island. Like I wanted to say like, my type on paper. So what's your type on paper then? Actually on paper. On paper. And on paper. To be fair, I, I did watch a bit of last season's Love Island and um, it's annoyingly entertaining. I'll give it to them. I haven't actually read any of them and I've been, I wouldn't say grilled by fans, but have had fans, you know, roll their eyes and tuck when I, when I haven't read the books. And then when I've been filming any of the movies and read certain aspects of the book because so much has to change sometimes I'm like I well I wish I didn't know that or now I'm acting from a place where I understand something that's happened in the books and now I can't get it out of my gut or my head I have to stand up and back myself and say the reason I never read them in the first place was because I was so aware of how much has to change when you adapt a book into a film and I stand by that man I really really do but I have made a promise that I'm gonna start and at least read the first one when it's all said and done. But we're not done yet. I haven't seen a single Star Wars and now I kind of respect it as an aspect of myself. It's a good little like icebreaker because then the hardcore Star Wars fans are like, what? Flipping tables, like you haven't seen Star Wars? I haven't actually read any Harry Potter books even though I'm in that, so. But no one wants to come for me for that one. <laughs> My first paycheck was a hundred pounds cash in hand from one of my dad's friends who was making a movie called Bigger Than Ben. And it's kind of like Oliver Twist-esque, but modern day about some pickpockets. And I have to steal some chocolate and my brother catches me. And it was like one day's work. I did it more for the day of school. I said, mum, let's go straight to Lily White's. It used to be like a big sports store and I got a full West Ham kit because I support West Ham with my name on the back. I'll never forget. That's what I first spent my first, my first paycheck on, yeah. I'm sure I do. It's definitely in a box in storage. Weirdly, I got H. Tiffin, which no one does. I don't know why I got like my first initial and a dot and then my surname, but anyway. Thank you so much, Pop Sugar.